Ooh, it's a dark and spoopy and stormy night here on the ocean. There's a platform over there. I think that's the one we did in the last episode, right? I hope it was. Dang it. What ha yeah, it was, because then we went to that submarine. Okay, what's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker. Ugh. In the last episode, we got more Triforce pieces. We went to the cabana, which I was really excited to go to. Um... And yeah, we made it to Bomb Island, which I've heard many things about. Um, first of all, there's a Goron dude over here. Let's see what you have to say, Mr. Dude, that's trying to hide his face. Hey, have we met before somewhere? Aren't you? No, could it be? Me? I'm but a poor traveling merchant. I travel the world searching for rare objects of all sorts, modern and ancient, foreign and exotic. My dream was always to build something to open my shop. The plans have a way of getting delayed, and now it's been 30 years since I. That's sad. Wow, that's really sad. Time certainly laughs at us, huh? Wow, that's sad as well. <laughs> and still, day in, day out, rain or shine, I spend my days looking for curiosities and rare items. Which reminds me, that delivery baby of yours... Wow, he, this guy doesn't... Wow, the other two Goron trading merchants always had like a reason for coming to the islands that are at. Like a specific reason. Like, there's treasure in that island, I could smell it. And then, at the mother and child island, and then at this... Uh, and at, um, Great Fish Island... He just thought because the island was destroyed, there's gonna be some unearthed treasure. And this guy is just here, and he doesn't really know what he's doing. That's really sad to me. Oh, look at that. I figured you might see that crap. I really want to get over there, though. It's interesting that those guys came up. Oh, by the way, in the Forbidden Woods, um, some of these came up. You guys don't remember this, probably, at this point. Because it was a very long time ago. But they came up. In the room where there's like a nut on the ground and they circled them and they didn't move. They just popped up and they didn't move. Well, I've since found out that um, it was in fact a glitch like I initially thought it was. Just by watching all the playthroughs and watching it like they're moving with other people. It, it, like they'd pop up but they wouldn't move and it was really like unsettling because you know you're used to the moving. There's gonna be like a blue chew here. I'm gonna bolt this up and I'm also gonna bolt the blue chew or some crap. I think it feels like an island that a blue chew would be on. Right, let's go down, downtown Bikini Bottom. I don't know why I think of downtown. I think of downtown Bikini Bottom. That's really where. Oh no, this place! I remember this place. Oh crap! All right, dang it! Where is he? It was like he had to walk on that to get this guy to come. Does that affect you? No. All right, pick you up. Hey girl, come here often. Oh no, there's a multiple one! No, drop it! I'm pressing, I'm pressing. ZR to drop, ZR to drop. Oh, I missed! Oh, oh really? His weight doesn't, oh, okay. All right, okay, he might transform back in a second here. Uh, oh, I feel like he was just about to, okay. This island, geez. Holy crap, it sucks. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Ah. Uh, okay, so that was kind of like the whole hint there. This place is gonna have to do deal a lot with. Where, where is he? With the balls? Yes, yeah, I has a lot to do do with um, dealing with hitting those guys and the balls and putting them on the switches. Is there just not one there? Oh, okay. Huh. Oh no! Does it start me over? It might start me over. <laughs> Excuse me while I make a little snorting noise. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, that's a fi that's fine. I don't care. I'll lose the half hard gladly. All right, this is where things get a bit dicey. All right, you, sir. No, come on. All right. Okay, pick you up. And yeah, yeah, you you bite over there, dude. See, ah, cur. Huh. So we want to throw him in there. And thankfully, it's pretty lenient. Oh, there we go. Don't fall in, please. Holy crap, that was really close. It's pretty lenient. Like, if you throw it in there, it's almost always going to take it as good. Uh, oh, roll into there. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's kind of weird. I feel like that platform there was supposed to st stop as soon as, like, you know, I activated that one or whatever. I, I wonder what that is over there. I might Deku Leaf over there once I get the treasure here. Just see what it is. And wow, this was a lot easier than I remember it being as well. All right, let's open this up and see what we got. Oh boy, looks like there's gonna be something cool in here. <gasps> we got the, we got a piece of heart. Yay, that was fun. I guess it's really it, dang it. 
Oh man, now I'm really tempted to just leave the room since we're at the door anyways. Ah, screw it. We're never gonna be here ever again, so let's... Like, that rock... Oh no, dang it, I didn't want to pull that out yet. No! Okay, I was gonna say, please don't fall in. Like, the bomb won't reach from here, right? Oh, it does blow up. Okay. Let's deck leaf over there, because we got at least deck leaf onto that, I know. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, maybe we can't. Well, we can also backflip. I mean, there's a lot of work for absolutely nothing, because there's going to be nothing over there, but I really... It's just one of those things, you know. Okay. Aha! Now go, go, go! What?! Are you serious?! Oh, I stepped into the ledge. Something mm, stupid. Try one more time. If I don't get it, then I'll cut till I get there. Yes, I really want to get on that ledge really badly for no reason at all. Get over it. Get over it. Oh, man. No, it always makes me go that way for some stupid reason. No! Oh, I could totally do that somehow. I know I can. I know I can. It's just because I turned backwards for whatever reason when I tried to start jumping. Okay, maybe just jump off this. No, it doesn't let me. It just drops me off for some stupid reason. That is the stupidest stoop I've ever stooped. Okay, see you guys in a second. I want to get this. <gasps> I did it! I did it! Yay! I did a... Well, you guys, I, I definitely showed what I did there. Yay! Uh, it did absolutely nothing. Just like I thought it... It totally looked like something you could bomb though, right? I don't know. That was really stupid, I realized. There's no point to that at all. And wow, I'm down to 60 bombs. That is horrible. Well, at least I got to live out my dream. My dream team. Alright, let's get to the light. The beam of light. Yay! Alright. Uh, where's the king we got? I thought I just saw a big hurricane for a second there. Okay. Oh, you know what? There's another thing I want to do. I need magic for it. I'm gonna get to those pots that those vines are guarding. Ah, oh, there's... Seriously, game? Are you gonna give me nothing here? Did I waste all my magic in that cave to get to that one platform of nothingness for no reason at all? Come on! Alright, let me find some magic. Okay, I'm back. Now, you may be wondering, what could possibly be in those pots over there that are guarded so heavily? By those assholes, those asshole vines, and I probably didn't even need to change the wind there. Oopsies, oh well. Okay, I don't know where these appear, so I'm gonna go as far as I can. There we go. Should be good. And two rupees, great. And five rupees, wonderful. And really? I did this all for 17 rupees? I thought I remember the reward for that being really stupid. Like, what's the point of these? And is it coming out actually look at the map? The reason why it's called Bomb Island? Your mind's about to be blown. It's because it looks like a bomb. Yep. It's as lame as that. And maybe we'll get a better shot at that now. You see that? Actually, it looks more like a sperm, but we're not going to talk about that. Quite frankly, I'm pretty disgusted you would even mention that. Jesus. Why would you say that, yo? Also, I apologize for saying Jesus like that. Apparently, that's a really offensive thing to say sometimes. Um, well, all the time, if you say it negatively. Um, <clears throat> let's look at her bottles. Poor grandma. Granny ma. You know what, dude? All that time you said you took that picture, you could have been healing your grandma. What the heck, man? Jeez, so disrespectful. Disrespectful. Alright. Get to the last square of this row. Man, I don't know what goes on after that. Probably nothing. <laughs> My life probably ends at that point. What is this island? With the fingers and the things. Ooh, I think there's an island we need a Hoi pair for, which thankfully we still have a bunch of. Eh, I think this is good. I think it might be a bit farther back, actually. I think it's where the swell intersects, like right here. No! Ah, oh, man. Some of these buttons, there we go. That's better. Yay! What are we gonna get? I'm so excited! We got the silver ruby! Yay! 200 rupees. Uh, that was so exciting and wonderful. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, hmm, actually, I don't really recognize this island. Uh, interesting. 
Okay, this is the island I thought it was, but I don't recognize like what it looks like. This is I know I know of this island. I don't know what it is. Here we go with my hidden ship that I'll never see and I'll complete all about com completely forget all about. To reach Southern Fairy Island, head north from here. Where are they giving direction to those places? It's like those places aren't really significant. I mean, unless you're having a really hard time finding upgrades. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Like those are the islands that all the things point to. It's also really weird how there's a post box here. This island has nothing on it. <laughs> the tiny little rock in the middle of the ocean. Hmm. There's a gate there. What would happen if I went like this? By this, I mean. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Alright. I don't want to let go. I want to let's play. Ha <laughs> ha! You see what I did there? I'm going to crawl up here. Yeah, this is one of the few times in this game that it kind of... I mean, you don't need to do it. Oh, man. I don't, I don't want to deal with your crap, mate. Oh, what? That's supposed to... Huh? It, it doesn't affect him, really? Well, fine. Whatever, asshole. Deal with that. Yeah, that's what I thought. Jeez. Well, I don't collect this blue chew jelly. Okay. Now, once again, your best bet... Just kill as many of these assholes as you can. Oh, that actually did. That actually worked. I'm kind of surprised. I didn't think that would hit him. Oh, holy crap. Wow. I took. You could just. How long it took to hit him? That just goes to show, like, how far of a shot that is. Oh, I think that might hit. Yeah. I think there's one behind there, and I don't think we're going to be able to hit that one from all the way over here. Okay. Let's go over. Let's just see where that's going to take us. I think that'll hit if we shoot soon enough. Let's just start shooting now. Oh, it's a bit low, maybe. Oh, dang it. I just realized I'm moving the wrong way here. I meant to be moving that, but I was actually taking 40 steps. I just realized if we spam arrows, they go different trajectories than if we didn't spam it. Okay, you know what? I think that's okay. Let's try it now. Let me take out oh, we only have two. I thought we had three still. Oh man, may not be good. May not be good news for me for all the Mr. Christophers in the world. So if we go to these nests, eh, yay! There's little switches in them, and I think there's a switch in each and every one of them. All right, we're gonna want to stay clear of the top one, so we absolutely need to go up there. Oh, yeah, we have two birds here. What? Why did that not activate? We need to flop our wings. Oh man, I hear him. Eh, it's really scary. It's so scary, man. Dude, my feet are touching! <laughs> Beats! There we go. Okay, my wing touched it. Oh boy. I think the less risky one is this one. Fly into the sunset, seagull. Okay. And I have one more. And I think if we get hit by one of these birds, we have to start over and all the switches deactivate. I think. I could be wrong. Uh-oh. I think one spotted me. Yep. All right. Fly, 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 fly. All right. That's where things get interesting here. Yes, I got it. All right, one more. One more at the top here. Come on. Yes, I did get it. Holy crap, I thought I was going to miss. Woo! I think they're faster than you if you don't flap your wings. Right, whatever. Oh, oh, I thought there was more over there, but no, those are more seagulls. Oh, the blue chew just disappeared. For some reason, I didn't think that disappeared. Well, I hope that didn't cause it to despawn forever. I don't think so. I think as long as you don't collect it, I think I should be good. This is a, really? I didn't realize it's giving me Triforce. At least that's what I'm assuming. That's what the Triforce here is for. And by all the loot it's given me. I was in the 20 rupees and all these green rupees. and call them blue rupees. Don't be ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. I'll honestly be curious to see how um, the game grums deal with this area. Because I haven't watched that far into their Let's Play yet. Since, you know, I'm trying. I don't want to spoil myself of stuff. Even though I know what's going on. But still, I want to experience the game before I see it. So I'll be curious to see how they react to this area. See, like, if they realize they could grapple, use the grappling hook, and then 
and climb up. You know what? They probably won't even think to kill the birds off before trying to use a seagull to hoi parry either. That's even more hilarious. You got a chopper shot. You can't yourself, so you have to get deciphered somewhere. All right. Okay, so now that we have all three Triforce charts, what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to go get them all translated and then continue my travels once I do that. Oh, well, there's my skip. I did get this. Is this island? Oh, I don't think it is, is it? Is this is a mystery island still? It is a mystery island still. All right, let's see what this one's called then. Ooh, we still have a hoi pair left. That's awesome. So I know we need at least one hoi pair to get like a heart piece somewhere else. We're not going to be at the island for a very long time yet. Not, I guess not a very long time, but it's in the last row. Actually, it's an island that we've already been to before. Right, what do you have to say? Nom, 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 nom. Boy, small fry. How did I know he was going to say that before he even said it? I don't freaking know. I'm probably a genie. And it is called... I wonder how accurate these drawings are. Bird's Peak Rock! Is there a shiny light thing here? I feel like there should be. Tell me, Small Fry, have you ever heard of the Golden Triumph Forts? They're there on that island, or at least a chart leading to them is there. Was it hidden, you ask? Well, for that sort of that, you'll have to ask a goal. <laughs> That's cool. I like their like, subtle hints. They don't like kind of hold your hand and tell you exactly what to do. I like that. It's a lot better than, you know, the way they sometimes tell you exactly how to do something. Without, like, it's not even a hint at that point. It's just, here, just do this. You know what? I don't even want to deal with freaking giving you subtle hints because I hate when people have to figure out how to play a game. Okay, so we're done here, yes? Let's go over here. Meh. No, not, no, come on. Jeez. <laughs> you can tell my frustration there from the sensitivity not working the way I wanted to. Make sure I don't have any unopened charts here. Alright, looks like we're fine. We're almost, we've almost collected all the charts, you guys. That's kind of crazy. Okay, so, looks like we only have two more, at least, like, uh, Triforce pieces itself to collect. And I guess, I guess three, five in total. Um, when you count all the treasure charts we have here. Alright, so let's just check our charts here. Platform charts. Alright, there's gonna be one over there. And Beetle, I don't care about. Okay, so now, I'm gonna quickly pull this up. I'm gonna teleport over to the person that can decipher our charts for. Or can decipher our charts. So, who's actually told us? Nope. That they like charts before? Well, it's Tingle. That's right, for some reason, he can decipher treasure charts. I don't really understand why. I think maybe it has something to do with the fact that in um, Majora's Mask, he was the guy you could buy maps to an area for. Like, I guess he likes maps for whatever reason. I mean, it's, it seems a little bit weird to me. Especially for people who haven't played, like, Majora's Mask. Like, how the heck would they know to do this? <laughs> but I did just talk about, like, you know, hand-holding a game. But it's still, that's, like, a really random character to have to cipher your maps. But I think, I'm pretty dang sure he did bring it up in this game a few times. So I guess it's fair. Oh my god, it's Moblin! Oh my god, it's fairies! Oh my god, oh, that's the last thing. Oh my god, it's a tingle head on top. Hold two? Why is there two? Why? I, what? Cult leader Wink. Oh, so long, Gale Island. So long, Gay Bowser. Oh no, I don't want to say that. Dang it. Whatever. Cult leader Link. All right. Oh, Mr. Fairy, I've been longing to see you, sir. What should we play? What do you want to play? What? You're not here to play? Hmm. That fragrant, musty scent, sir. Your clone sounds sexy. Smells sexy. You haven't found a chart. Splendid, splendid! Show me, show me! Why? You can't read this chart in its current state! Impossible, sir! Would you like me to decipher for you for 398 rupees? I have no idea why it's 398. There's probably some trivia on that. I don't remember what it is, though. Or maybe I've never looked it up. I don't freaking know. Tingle, tingle! Kulu limpa! Become readable! Uh, you got your chart deciphered! Now you can use it to find a piece of the Triforce. Look at your C-chart on the map screen and see if it's the current location. Should we decipher another chart for 398 rupees? Tingle, tingle, kalimpa! I'm really curious how much it would cost in the original game. So I'm going to quickly do that math in my head. Definitely not on my ca my calculator. Oh man, of course it's not in my immediate view here. Yeah, i do the other one while I try to look for my free... Oh, there's my calculator. Alright. 398. I don't remember if it's 8 or 7. I think it's 8. Uh, 3,184 rupees it takes. If it is 8. Let's go confirm that. Hmm, Mr. Fairy, you must try very hard to find treasure. 
Yeah, and then he just explains how to collect treasure, which is weird. Then just go to the place where I'll enter the shark to find the treasure. Let's see. I want to make sure it's eight. Cause not dang. Stop. God, the sensitivity. Oh. Oh, these are Triforce maps. They are. Look, they're purple sides. You see, if we go to the fourth one, it'll be blue. Of course, these are all ones we've clicked. See, it's blue sides on the treasure shard itself. There. If we go over to here, it's purple. I don't know what island that is. Maybe it's one we haven't been to yet. I don't know what island that is. I don't know what. Is that the Forsaken? No. What kind? Oh, that's Great Fish Island. I bet. Huh. Interesting. Okay. So. Now we're done with that. Oh yeah, I was gonna check the. I knew I was forgetting something. Is there eight? One, two. Oh, it, it tells me where the trap force piece. Oh, interesting. Maybe I should go get those right now then. Well, nah, we'll do it on our way back through to get Triforce pieces. Okay, so it looks like one, two, three. Oh, wait, two, four, six, eight. So there's eight. So yeah, 3,184 rupees to get all your charge translated, which I really don't think is too much. Unless you don't realize there's uh, upgrades in the game you can make to your wallet. That's, I mean, I guess that could be a pretty significant reason why maybe people would rage quick because they would always play the game with only like the original wallet which only holds 500 rupees that's so weird to me uh yeah the forest haven no we're not gonna start there i guess we'll sail there and then we'll call an episode there Whee! so much fun haha <laughs> oh what fun it is to fly on the freaking gosh dang winds hey i don't even know if there's anything for us to do here to be honest hmm. that's okay because we don't, have, we don't have to concern ourselves with that yet all right we want to go this way we want to go yonder right yeah we do want to go yonder oh looks like there's a treasure we get there but we'll deal with that when we get there all right we're going to this island yeah interesting our treasure chart tells us exactly where to go oh yeah there's a watchtower over here oh it's the fish uh huh. Oh, looks like this is like a little outshoot of like the um, the, the the forest haven. There's a lot of trees on this island, considering it's landmass. I think there's only like three trees, but it still looks pretty grassy and stuff. Nice, yeah. small fry. Yeah, yeah. Treasure chart or sea chart and stuff. I don't know what this island is. So let's find out together. <laughs> Cliff Plateau Islands, Isles, Isles, not islands. Just stoop. Hey, small fry, do you know about the Nintendo Gallery? The only way to get, the, get in there is to hit a switch that's way high up in the Forest Haven. But the only way to do that would be to grab one of the goals by putting a little bait on your head. <laughs> I wonder, like, if I ever read that and thought, hmm, do I have to, like, place the like, fish bait on my head? That sounds weird. Probably not. I don't feel like I'm that stupid. Uh, you know what? Just so it's easier for me, I'm going to start off on this watchtower in the next episode. So yeah, I guess I'll call it an episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe already. Whoa, what the heck? Okay, we're just gonna hide under here then. Oh crap, you might actually be able to hit me from here. Can you hit me from here? Oh. What? He can't? Oh man, really? Bye then. I can't hit him, can I? I, I totally can't hit him. Come on. Where did he, where, what? I hope this one single arrow kills him without using magic. Ah, I can't hit him. Are you serious? Am I gonna die to this asshole? There he is. Ah. Oh, come on. Ah. What, what did I just aim at? Hello? Come on, there we go. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Unless the other one could spawn behind me. No, it doesn't see me can. Yeah, thank you guys so much for- What is that wind doing? It's going all crazy, isn't it? Maybe not. Okay, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye-bye!